I am Erica, and I'm a founder at a startup. Uh, we were using SimScale, and then we switched to Ansys Fluent. For more reviews like this, click below. We use these products to model wind flows um, over different building structures. Uh, tends to be some pretty complex environments, um, and there's a lot of things that we're trying to understand about how the wind is moving. ANSYS Fluent is great when you really need to be able to customize what you're doing and have a lot of control over the entire process. Uh, it takes a little bit more expertise to run, uh, but it's really well-tested code and there's a lot of support. SimScale is great for people who are new to computational fluid dynamics or finite element analysis because they have uh, really good training to spin up. The user interface is easy to learn and there's lots of support on the site. There's a chat feature where you can contact support directly and get a response really quickly. There's also a huge database of example projects that other people have uploaded and you can reference that if there's something similar to what you want to be modeling just to sanity check what you're doing. Uh, and all the computing is on the cloud so you don't need to have your own computing capacity. Getting start started with SimScale was, was very easy. They provided a great training program and uh, I was able to be up and running with the software in about a week without having a lot of previous expertise. Um, getting started with ANSYS requires a little bit more expertise and setup time, especially if you're using your own equipment. Uh, we had a consultant train us on how to use uh, some of the software and had to work with the ANSYS team a little bit, but once we got it figured out, um, it's been it's been pretty pretty user friendly. No custom code or anything required. Our top considerations are ease of use. Uh, how much time are we going to be spending fiddling with bugs in the software or um, fine tuning anything? And accuracy. Uh, do we trust the code that the software is running on? Um, and uh, do we believe that the results are right for the type of modeling that we're doing? Um, it's also really important to have good support uh, from uh, the, the software team uh, because these are, tend to be things that uh, need a lot of support.